So game three between the Panthers and Hurricanes tonight. The Hurricanes are looking to get back in the series with a win, while the Panthers are looking to take a commanding 3-0 series lead. Let's break down the game. Let's pick this one up just over midway through the second with the Panthers on the power play. Bennett gets the puck down low and finds Kachuk in the corner as he would feed Reinhardt out front, who turns and fires a quick shot, which beats Anderson and gets the Panthers on the board. With just over two minutes to go in the third, after the Hurricanes pulled Anderson to try and tie it up, the Panthers appear to seal the win as Stahl scores on the empty net to put them up 2-0. However, the whistle was blown prior to the puck going in, but I don't think anyone heard it. After watching the replay, it appeared that Goss despair was high-sticked by Reinhardt and I thought a penalty was being called. After the refs gathered to discuss the play, it turns out that the whistle wasn't blown for a penalty, but it was because Goss Despair went down and the ref thought he was injured. Goss Despair very clearly got high-sticked in the face, but the ref didn't see it. From this angle here, you see the ref take his eyes off the play just as Goss Despair gets high-sticked. I'm really not sure why this isn't reviewable, because the Hurricanes kind of got screwed here. The goal would obviously not count due to the play being blown dead, but there was no penalty and the Panthers would hold on and take the win 1-0 as they now take a 3-0 series lead over the Hurricanes. This Panthers team just somehow keeps finding a way to win. Bobrovsky once again was absolutely outstanding as he earned his first career playoff shutout in this game. This was long overdue for him as he has been brilliant throughout the entire playoff so far and has been the MVP for the Panthers to say the least. As for the Hurricanes, they just could not find an answer for Bobrovsky. They had tons of great scoring chances. I thought they got plenty of traffic in front of the net tonight, but they just couldn't capitalize. I thought both teams were solid defensively, and I feel like I would be doing a disservice to Anderson if I didn't mention how well he played also. He only faced 17 shots tonight, but I thought he played very well, and he has been solid in all of his starts so far in the playoffs. I don't want to get ahead of myself and say this series is over, as you really never know, but the Hurricanes have a very tough task ahead of them if they're going to pull this one off. Despite there only being one goal scored in this game, I still found it very entertaining to watch as like I said, there were some great scoring chances by both teams. We'll see how the rest of the series plays out and I can't wait to watch. Let me know your thoughts below. Please like the video if you liked it and subscribe for more. Thank you so much for watching.